Now that we're reopened, let's go over our social distancing guidelines. On a nice day, classes will be conducted at the park. If not, we'll be waiting in line, one at a time, getting into the dojo. These red markings on the ground are two meters apart and show you where you can stand while social distancing. Please show up already dressed in your full uniform with your belt tied, including your mask. Face shields are an option and are much easier to breathe with. As you make your way towards the front door, you will be greeted by a figure and asked a few questions. Hold on a sec. Let me ask you a couple of questions first. Have you been around anybody who's traveled outside of Canada in the past two weeks? No. Have you been around anyone who's had to self-isolate in the past two weeks? No. Do you have a fever, a runny nose, or sneezes? No. Maybe a sore throat, headache, or not feeling well? No. Awesome. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take your temperature, and then we'll come into the dojo. Does it hurt? No, not okay. at all. I'm just going to point this at your forehead. <laughs> give a squeeze of the trigger. Awesome. Come on in. If you answered yes to any of those questions or displayed signs of illness, you will be sent home. One at a time, students will enter the dojo and put their shoes on the shoe rack. If they've brought a sweater, hoodie, or hat, they can leave it on the chairs. Afterwards, they must sanitize their hands. The change rooms will be completely off limits. Nobody can use the washrooms except for the students during the class. Students will be given a number upon bowing onto the mats. Nine is the closest and one is the furthest. To avoid contact, ones will be going onto the mat first, finding their sticker and staying in that place the duration of the class. Then twos, all the way up to nines. Upon leaving the class, nines will exit first, and lastly, ones. This way, students don't have to walk past each other. Here you can see the stickers are spaced out two meters apart and allow the students to follow the instructor without getting too close. Parents will need to wait outside the dojo and be on time for class and pickup. Our schedule is on our website at stovomartialarts.com.